The greatest threat to our planet is the belief that somebody else will save it. This is a quote by Robert Swan, who is the first person in history to walk both the North and the South Pole. But yes, he's right. We should take all responsibilities to make this world a better, cleaner and healthier place for us to live in. Hello Atlanteans! Hope you are doing well, safe and healthy. Welcome to your weekly briefing topic. This week we will be talking about the three R's of sustainability. We currently have a campaign, Clean and Green in Amsterdam. And I would like to share with you the three best practices so that as a community we can do all our bit to protect the environment we live in. The first R, reduce. This R is easy to understand. You should only use the resources that you really need, which therefore help you to reduce your waste. For example, from the AMSA Essential Store, please take only the required quantity of shampoo and lotions. Think about avoiding single-use items, such as plastic straws and plastic cutlery. And take your cotton shopping bags with you when you go for grocery shopping to all day and joy drops. Here's a challenge for you. Let's start easy by eliminating one single-use item in your daily life. For example, I stopped using plastic straws a long time ago. The second R is reuse. Instead of discarding an object, you can seek for an alternative purpose for that item. Recently at AMSA, we noticed that a few of our residents reuse plastic bottles as plant pots. You can use your empty food containers for storage of cereals and spices instead of throwing them away. Additionally, instead of also discarding away your old or unwanted clothes, you can donate them for charity by dropping them at the charity containers provided outside S1, S5, M1 and M2 buildings at AMSA. When I finish reading a book, I leave it in the AMSA library for other colleagues to read it as well. Maybe you could do the same and we could all share some. And finally, the third R, recycle. Recycle is the process of turning used materials and waste into new products. A lot of our household waste can be broken down and reprocessed to make new things. This process uses less energy and resources than making items new, so it offers a big boost to our environment. At AMSA, when you recycle your waste, you need to know where and how to dispose of your waste correctly. You can use the designated garbage bins all around AMSA and please remember to segregate them correctly. For example, plastic goes in the plastic container and your glass waste goes in the glass container. When we all take these little steps, we make a huge difference together. We also have an electronic waste collection drive up coming very soon. Old electronic devices contain toxic substances such as lead, mercury, cadmium. Proper processing is essential to ensure that these materials are not released into the environment. So, remember what we have learned today. The three R's of sustainability. Reduce, reuse and recycle. Atlantis, I would like to encourage all of you to practice the three R's of sustainability. So here's a question for you. What will you do today to make your home and AMSA a cleaner and greener place for you and all your colleagues? Please share your comments with us in the comment section of this video so that we can inspire and help each other to preserve our environment at AMSA. And finally, we do not inherit the earth from our ancestors. We borrowed it from our children. So let's give our family, friends and all the children at AMSA a great place to live in. Thank you Atlanteans for watching. I look forward to see you all soon in the next episode of the weekly briefing topic. And just wanted to wish you and your family Eid Mubarak.